Which of these trucks is the best off-road? Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. Ah! Land Rover Defender. This is good, isn't it? Or the old Land Rover Def... Oh, actually, it's the Ineos Grenadier. Oh, Sam, you're gonna kill us! To find out, I'm gonna compare these three cars off-road with my two chums. <laughs> Oh, blooming X, Sam! Jeez! <laughs> Look how wet I am. Let me tell you how this video is going to work. The cars will score points in each challenge they take part in. There'll be three points for a win, two points for coming second, one point for the car that comes last. If any car is disqualified, it will get no points in that particular challenge. The first challenge is a drag race uphill over mud. Now, before we get into that, let me tell you about this Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. It has a two litre four cylinder turbocharged petrol engine that churns out 272 horsepower and 400 newton meters of torque. Driving all four wheels, well, you can actually drive two wheels only, but it's a switchable all wheel drive system. It has a high range mode, a low range mode. It's also got lockable front, central and rear diffs and disconnectable anti-roll bars. This Jeep Wrangler Rubicon costs £63,000. Now let's find out about the Defender from its driver, Nick. Hi, Matt. This is the baby Defender in terms of size. So it's the 90, the three door. This is not the baby in terms of engine though. It's the D300. So it's the three litre turbocharged straight six diesel. It's got 300 horsepower, 650 newton meters of torque. It's got an eight speed automatic gearbox with high and low range, all wheel drive and all in. One of these will set you back about £68,000. But this particular car is over 90. All the goodies in here. Five Finally, the Ineos Grenadier. Go on, Sam, give us the stats. Hello, Matthew. Yeah, so this is the Ineos Grenadier. It's a three litre twin turbo straight six. It's a BMW, it's the B57 engine. 249 horsepower, 550 newton meters of torque. So a lot less than Nick, just saying. All wheel drive, eight speed gearbox. This car starts from 76,000, but the one I'm currently in has a few little tricky bits on it. So it brings it up to 79 grand. That's all the facts and figures. Let's get on with the race. Let me tell you how this is gonna work. So we're gonna run it a bit like a rally. We'll time each car, add up their time for the entire course, and the car that completes the entire course in the least time wins. Let's get into this. Right, what I'm gonna do is run my car in four wheel drive high, because I think we might get some speed up, and if I'm in low, it'll just make it go too slowly. Diff locks, can I lock them? Go into neutral, maybe. Lock, actual lock cancelled. No, lock, damn you. Won't let me lock the diffs. Maybe you can only do it in low. Oh well, we'll just try like this. Okay, we're gonna go four wheel drive, low range mode, low traction launch, perfect. Rear diff, front diff, centre diff. It's gonna win. Three, two, one. Come on, GP. Go! I'm not going anywhere! God, that Grenadier is just absolutely buggered off. Whoa, I'm doing some sideways action. This is fun, actually. I like this. Matt, what are you doing in my lane? Go away. What is going on with that Land Rover? <laughs> Does he need a tow? This is just ridiculous. Nick, you're supposed to be in the best 4x4x4. Not so on this occasion. So this Defender has a special low traction launch mode. It just didn't seem to work. And Sam, in your Grenadier, you just buggered off. Like a scalded cat, this, isn't it? I wonder if the actual lanes that we're going on made a difference. Nick, I'm gonna do you a little favor here, mate. Why don't we all move across once? And I think on this occasion, I'm gonna follow Sam's lead and go with stability and traction off. Yeah, in the arse. Yes, please! Ah, Samuel!
That was interesting, guys. I'm very glad that we decided to do it again in different lanes. Aren't you, Nicholas? That was so much better. I had a little play around with my settings and I found the more wheel spin button. That's actually what Land Rover calls it. And it definitely helped. Oh, Sam, you weren't so far ahead this time, were you? You put me in your churned up lane. So can I go into the middle lane now? Can we do one more moving over? Let's go. This is the final race. I'm pulling like a meter. Video. Why don't we all just line up with Nick? I mean, I'm not going anywhere when we start, am I? That's very much a you problem, Nick. <laughs> all right, hang on, hang on then. Is there something I should be doing? Yeah, pulling up for a drag race, Nick. I am genuinely stuck. I, I cannot go forward. What do you think would happen? Say in Formula One, all the cars can't get onto the start line. They would push that car out of the way. We'd crack on. <laughs> 10 minutes later, I'm finally here. Not gonna lie, Sam, I think this is the race between you and I. Three, two, one. Come on, hook. I thought you'd hook more than that. Come on, defender, don't, don't let me down again. Oh, come on. Oh, blooming X, Sam. Jesus. Watch this, I'd accidentally crash at the end. Whoa. <laughs> Do you know what, Sam? You were pretty close to me then. I've got a horrible feeling that you may have, out of the three runs, the lowest time overall. Okay, then what's the results? Grenadier, one overall. Ah! 39.8. Oh. The Wrangler came second, 54.9. What? Blimey, that's miles ahead. And then the Defender was 60.77. I was actually closer to the Defender than the Ineos. Is that the car or is it Sam? I don't know. Hmm. Still plenty to play for. That's three points to the Ineos, two to the Jeep, and one to the Land Rover. For the next challenge, we are gonna time the cars down a steep decline, and the car which goes down the slowest wins. Okay then, Nicholas, do you wanna start us off with your lovely Land Rover Defender 90? I will, I've got it in mud and ruts mode. I've got hill descent control on. Yeah, let's see how we get on. Okay, this is actually quite spooky then. It's caught me, I can feel it doing things. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Is he down that hill yet? <laughs> that was pretty scary. So what was the time? 8.95 seconds. Okay then, Sam, you've got to do it slower than 8.95 seconds. Oh God, okay. Right, steering angle is down, I'm off the hill. That wasn't very hill descenty. Uh, Sam, are you all right? It's like you just fell off the edge of a cliff. My understanding of hill descent is different to that. <laughs> that was more of a gravity jeep descent. Formal protest, Nick made it all slippery. Did you have light hill descent control on? The traction control was off, I believe, but everything else was on for hill descent mode. I'm a bit frightened because if I go straight on when I come down this hill, I end up in some kind of metal container. I don't really need to ask this, but that was a lot quicker than next time, wasn't it, Jack? So Sam did it in 5.53 seconds, so almost double. So I've got my cruise control, 0.6 MPH. If I don't get any traction, I'm just gonna slide. Come on, Jeep! Hold farm, America! America! Yeah! Coming once again to say the mother day, yeah! That's quite good. 
I won that. This thing was totally controlled right from the top and just went into it at 0.6 miles an hour. I think I might have had probably far too much steering lock. That's quite a lot of lock. God, just give me the time. Whoa, go Jeep. Sam, you were rubbish at that. Any type of man from Idios, they need to work on their heavy descent control. <laughs> In this next challenge, we're going to find out which car can make it the furthest up this hill. We're going to start from this cone and then just accelerate as best as we can. And we'll see which one has the best traction on this horrendous slippery slope. We're going to go low range, all my diffs locked. Let's just floor it and go for it. You ready? Here we go. Come on, car. That's it, that's as far as I made up the hill. That was rubbish. My problem was I changed gear. Go on then. Oh, that's looking good. Oh no. Oh, it's gonna be close. If you slide down, it's where you stop. You've stopped. Did you beat me? Oh no! I win. I haven't had a go yet. You haven't won anything, Sam. Land Rover's famous traction control system. Maybe it will just prevail. Go on then, Nicholas, your turn. I don't think this car's going very far at all. I just want to say that you two have dug trenches in this hill. We've made it nice and smooth, Nick. Look, it's like a freshly tarmacked road. Just get on with it. Interesting approach. Still going, go, go Nick, go, go on. No, oh, no, it was, oh. It's where you stop. He had won that until he stopped and then he slid back and now he's, he's lost. <laughs> You snatched defeat from the jaws of victory. You're my hero. So that's a win for you then, Samuel. Of course it's a win for me, but thank you for acknowledging it. Right, let's go on to the next challenge. That's seven points for the Jeep, seven points for the Ineos, and four points for the Land Rover. Aww. Want to sell your car quickly, easily, and for a fair price? Then head to CarWow to have over 4,000 trusted dealers ready to bid on it in an online auction. First, enter your car's registration to get an instant approximate valuation. Then, if you want to proceed, give us some more details and upload some photos, and we'll help you set a fair reserve price for your car. That's the minimum amount you'd be happy to sell it for. Once you've done that, we'll enter your car into an online auction. When the auction's over, we'll let you know the result, and the dealer with the winning bid will be in touch to arrange easy payment and free collection of your car. 93% of sellers surveyed said they got the price they expected or more through CarWow. The best bit is, it's completely free. I put a link in the description of this video and the pinned comment to take you directly to CarWow where over 4,000 dealers are ready to bid on your car. Or you can just click on the pop-out button that should be appearing in the top right-hand corner of the screen now. Alternatively, just Google help me CarWow and we will help you sell your car quickly, easily and for a fair price. On with the video. For this next challenge, we're going to see how smoothly these cars can traverse a rutted track. Not really driving very far, it's only about 10 metres, but we're going to add a bit of jeopardy to it. We're going to fill this cup with water and we'll see how much water is left in the cup after we've driven the course. We're going to put the cup in between Sam's legs. So I'm going to fill this up now very carefully. Yeah, carefully. Heated seat. Oh, oh, that was nearly me. So we're going to fill it right up. I don't. Up. There we go. You're setting me up to fail no, already. I've, I've given you, look, there's about half a centimetre. Right. Actually, do you know what? That's too full. Yes, I agree. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm good to you. I've now got a wet leg. Yeah, that was good, isn't it? So I, I can set myself up now. Okay, so nice and smooth, Sam. We don't want any of that spilling out. No. No. Oh. See, this is the hard bit now because I need to get in the gas. Oh, oh, you did a really good job. I think you're going to do this. Oh. No. Oh, no, what's oh. up? 
<laughs> oh, you're so lucky to have got out of that. I've got to say, mighty fine driving, though you do have to get between the I'm clones. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, come on. If you don't get between the two cones, you have to go again. Okay, <laughs> typical Matt, let's make rules up as we go. Oh. No. I think you're going to do this. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's going to get... Oh, oh it's... You, you. Yeah! <laughs> well done. My turn. And we'll keep that because you didn't drop any and we'll just put it straight in between my legs. I wouldn't celebrate too much because you did hit the cone. Fine. Fine. <laughs> he doesn't care. He doesn't care. He's got it. <laughs> right, my turn then. Let's get the cup with the same amount of water because you didn't spill any. That looks like less. No, oh, why are you... Why would he do that? He's more likely to put more in, isn't he? Ready? Yeah, go for it. I'm nervous. Come on, G. Nice and smooth. Don't even look at the cup, man. Just traverse <laughs> easily. Uh. <laughs> 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 I've got a bit. Oh no, and I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> You've missed it. I've missed the entire thing. Back it oh. up over that really bumpy bit again. No, oh, that's... Is, this, is this zero points? Don't suddenly bite, because I'm going to get very wet if it bites. Right, let's see if I can sort of like... It's hard this bit, isn't it? Slide in. This doesn't <laughs> work, it's just going... Oh! Back off? No. Whee! But you spilt water. So? You win it by having the most amount of water still left in it. Yeah. Me. Yeah, yeah, you did, but then you were disqualified for hitting the cone. So Nick, just a little bit look a little bit of seepage. Looks like I just put it away too soon, doesn't it? Finally then it's Nick's turn in the defender, so go on Jack, give me his cup. Oh, wait, 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 hang on, hang on. You put more in this. Either of you no, two you've just parked at a stupid angle. It looks like that. If you, park square, if, you park, it. if you park square like we did, it would be the same. The, the only way I am putting this between my legs is if you do it as well. I think that's fair. Yeah. It's not fair. It Absolutely. Fair. How is that in any way, shape or form fair? fair. Let me get some this cards. is typical Carwell statics. What? <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, okay, there let's just go. make sure that's, 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 that's all fair. That's all fair. Yeah, look at that. That looks like it's got more in it. No, 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 that's mine, that's yours. There we go. No worries, I got this for you right now. Oh, oh, oh wait a minute. Let's fill them all the same amount. Come yeah. on, let's get it even. No. <laughs> you can take a little bit out of it. Yeah, I will. Let's have a look, get it even. Go on, let's go. I really want you to win, Nick. I want to win too. God, this is ridiculous, isn't it? It is ridiculous. Because I've already won this. <laughs> Oi! What? There's nowhere to put it! You're going right, to damp it with your hands. Put it now, shut your legs. <laughs> Come on, shut your legs. I am! I want your hands where I can see them. Yeah. I'm going to get a hold of your ponytail. Oh no! <laughs> the faster you go, the harder I pull, Nick. <laughs> oh, oh, Nick! You've had another sip out of yours. I have not. The camera's been rolling the whole time. Nick, with my yes. straw. send it. Oh, I'm stuck anyway. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You dropped it out! <laughs> because I had no seat, did I? Oh, I've got the wettest cock and balls. Right, that deserves a big old pull. <laughs> We're all rather wet, but we need to know the score. So which car won that? I've no idea. It's going to have to be Matt. You spilled a little bit of water, but you did make it across and you didn't hit the cone. Nick spilled quite a lot of water. He spilled a lot of water. No, 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 no. He wait, spilled no. all of Turn the water. Around. Look how wet I am. He spilled a Look lot at that. Water. That is a London pint right there. Look at that. 
That is still water in there. Have you seen my cup? My cup is pretty much empty. It's all in here. <laughs> that sounds like a you problem to me. So that's two points to Nick. And then Sam did hit the cone. So, so we're going to have to just, no, zero. Hey, you got disqualified. <laughs> <laughs> so you can spill all the water and still pass and win. You can yeah. spill a little bit of water and win. I think you'll like the next challenge though. It's going to play to your strengths, yeah. okay? This next challenge is a race. We're going to drive a little rally course. We're going to time each car. The car that's the quickest wins. Now Sam's going to time me for this race for the Jeep, okay? Simple rules. You can have the car in whatever mode you want in terms of diff, but you've got to be in low range mode, automatic. So I've got my diff locks on and my stability control off. Do you want to count me in? Actually, actually, wait. Oh, you're ready. You're doing, get seat forward, watch your little legs. Oh. Right, I'm ready. <laughs> wait, no. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Three. <laughs> right, well. Two. No, I sh <laughs> One. Go. Oh, you bugger, get going. Have we started yet? Yeah? Oh, off. yes, we have. Oh, Why are you steering the wheel like that? I, it just looks good. <laughs> Lift off, get around the corner, because there are track limits. Oh, hello. Oh. <laughs> Where's this oh. corner going? Oh! <laughs> right. <laughs> 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 Okay, let's go again. <laughs> I think he's down there. Right, okay. You liar. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a jump. Whoa. <laughs> 47. There's a little bit of variance on that stop, but I think I stopped you just before, but it's fine. I think it's going to matter. Shut the camera. I just want to be out of this car. <laughs> I wasn't anticipating that hard right. No. At least you guys know that it's there now. Right then, it's next turn in the Defender. Remember that right turn. Oh, yeah, that right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right. So, three, two, one, go. Better start than I oh, have. Here we go. Ooh, spirited. Was this where I went off? No, 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 it was no the next no. one. You went off somewhere near Luton. <laughs> <laughs> There's your bush. <laughs> I think you might win. Come on, defender. Yes, this is the job. Oh! <laughs> well, you didn't beat me by all that much. Well, you did. Oh, it was 15 seconds back. Come on. That's a lot around the Nurburgring, let alone here. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so 32 uh, seconds. That's the time to beat Sam. Finally, then, Sam's turn in the Ineos. So, Nick, you time him. Three, two, one, go. Handbrake start. <laughs> Come on, Sam. Oh, yes. Oh, this feels a bit quicker. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the bad turn. Watson corner. <laughs> oh, Sam, you're going to kill us. Don't kill us. You're so determined to win. Watch out for the jump. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just in the score. Oh. oh, so what was mine? 32.28. The score 0.28. Is. Remember that 0.28? Well, there was that a lot of 0.28. Yeah. There was a lot of 0.28. Have a look at this. No! <laughs> <laughs> well done! 32.68. Oh. I yep. think you, when you lost it and went to the bushes. Yeah. Well held, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you should just understeer into another county. Oh, you know what that means, though, Nick? Three points to the defender, two <laughs> points to the Ineos, and one point to the understeery Wrangler. Oh. And that brings us on to the next challenge. The score so far. 11 for the Jeep, 9 for the Ineos, and 9 for the Land Rover. This final challenge is all about drifting. We're going to try and drift them around that cone, and points will be awarded by Jack based on how well they drift around that cone. I think we're going to let Nick go first in the Defender. Okay, centre and rear diff locks on, four wheel drive high because it doesn't let me choose between four and two. Look 
looking pretty good. Whoa, here we go. Where's all my power? No, not so much. Oh no, this is just a big oval. This isn't a donut. It was a bit of drifting, a bit of driving, wasn't it? If a donut came out of the factory that shape, it'd just get thrown in the bin. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna do any better, but I'm gonna give it a go. Stability off, rear diff only on. Go, okay, let's get into it. Go sideways and then in, go on, turn. Turn car, I'm not really doing very well later. Seem to be getting a long way from the cone. I'm now going very far away. Bye, cone. Let's go back that way. We just out the way. There we go. I'm not entirely sure what that was. Were the wheels spinning at all? I think the wheels were spinning more than you were, but yeah, they were hurling mud everywhere. That wasn't a great display. But now we come to the stunt driver who is paid to do precision driving, including drifting. So you should find this dead easy. Go on, Sam, show us how it's done. Go and get your three points. So that looked better than mine felt, if I'm being brutally honest. So what are the scores? Sam wins that, was graceful. So it's three points to the Ineos. Fairly close between you and Nick, but I'm gonna have to give it to the G. Yes! There was too much driving and too much drifting. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was really hard in this. Were you in low range mode? So I tried to go into high range mode and it wouldn't let me. I had to put it all back to where it was again. How about you? High range. Yeah, I was low range and it was just foot to the floor and it was just doing some stuff and it wasn't particularly good. But you won that. So 9 plus 3, 12 points. Yeah. 11 plus 2. Ugh, don't even bother. <laughs> it's 13 points. And 9 plus 1 is 10 points. Hey! <laughs> that means that the Jeep wins. The Ineos comes second. Land Rover Defender, it comes third. So to be fair, for most people, most of the time, it is the best car to have. Because it's by far and away the best to drive on road. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. Click on those windows there for some more videos. And on that box there, go to Car Wow to... Well, to have a little bit of a surprise. See you next time.